Yeah, you're right. It's been that way all afternoon. Didn't get a whole lot better there. On play action, Rodgers. He sets to fire deep. And, oh, a crusher there as it's intercepted. A great read, and it's picked off. And a big turnover there as his guys will get the football back. And not great starting field position here for the offense. Here's Murray now as they run it to start the drive. And he's up past the 10 to about the 12. A solid run on first down. Gain of seven leaves him with a second and three. The fourth quarter here, they've got the lead. They want to keep it on the ground. That's what they're doing. Smart football. Keep the clock grinding. Keep it going. But you got to figure now, they're going to see more people stacked up in the line of scrimmage as they try and bleed it out. Three yards to go on second down. Mariota off the play fake to Andrews. And complete to the tight end Walker right side. And he's brought down after a good game. He got 29 yards that time. That coach is always hard on the quarterback reading the defense and getting it to the open man. That's good recognition there. And how about what he did after the catch? Yeah, hit your tight end. Let him get some rack. Yeah, when he, when he gets moving, not many guys want to come over and put a hit on him, do they? A toss to Murray. Give him a couple on the carry there. Second and eight. That's a good play by the guys on the defensive side of the ball. Held him to a gain of two. And that changes the playbook a little bit now for the guy calling plays. Second and eight. Now he's got to probably think about going to the air instead of maybe staying with the ground game. And he'll lose yard. And now a timeout coming from the defensive side for the Packers. It's just their first. They've got two more to use here in the final stages. Now Mariota rolling to his right. And he can't get a throw off. He's taken down. What a huge play at this point in the game. Man, he got in there so quickly, Charles. What could the offense have done to adjust and account for that? But what you're hoping is that you figure out and you see and get a clue that maybe there's going to be some pressure coming at you. And you change the blocking schemes. Maybe you go to max protection. The biggest ones, maybe you bring your running back in to try and keep you clean. But in that case, that didn't happen. Zero accountability and a sack resulted. The Packers offense now, they get ready to head back onto the field. They're down here in a one-score game. But the time, it's a factor, but it's not a huge factor right now, is it? It's really not, because this amount of time gives them a chance to run their offense, to go through play sequences. And this is what they work on every week in practice, usually on a Friday. They go over this type of a situation, late game situation. What are we going to do when we have the opportunity? They've called these plays a bunch of times. Now's their chance to execute them. Well, they have the opportunity now. Here's the execution. Give them 13 on the pick up there. And it'll give the Packers a first down. And now they're in the hurry up. Back to throw. Caught by Montgomery. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. So the defense blitzed. A nice job picking that up, completing the pass. And how in sync was the quarterback in his center on that play? And he's got it. It's caught for a touchdown. And they have taken the lead here in the final seconds. So with next to nothing left on the clock, they get.